Hey guys, it's Jenny. It's the beginning of the spring semester of my sophomore year. And, ooh, I'm not even on my face. And basically, my room does not stay clean for a very long time. So, the fact that it's clean right now means I'm going to show you my room tour before I have a chance to not make it messy again. Like, it's my New Year's resolution to keep it clean, but we'll see how long that lasts. So, let's take a look at my tour. This is my um, college apartment, by the way. Do, do, do. <gasps> my room. So, let's start here. First thing we have is this mirror right behind the door. The most inconvenient place, but I didn't pick it. Um, by my door, I have these clippings from Vogue magazine. I think they're all from Vogue. The Emma Watson. Um edition or whatever you want to call it. In my little corner I have a fan, my blow dryer, and my strainer because I do it in front of the mirror. Um, and this is my adjuster that they gave me. It's four drawers. So I have a TV on the top which even though it has a DVD player, the DVD player is broken which is really sad so can't use that anymore. So I got some makeup, grenade fruities. This is all my jewelry keep it in there. It has a little bottom part too. This is a tap light mirror which I've done some tutorials on but I don't actually use it anymore now. It just kind of sits there. Here's all my perfumes, um, eye makeup remover, so that's that. First drawer is the unmentionables, bras and undies. won't show you that. Second drawer is all my shirts. Third drawer is all my jeans. And the last drawer is my pajama bottoms, yoga pants, sweatpants. So that is my dresser. I got a 10 pound weight on the floor which hasn't been used in a little bit of time. Um, this is a little three drawer divider thing that you can get like anywhere. Um, I think I probably got it at Target, Kmart, something like that. Um, top drawer I have stuff like cotton balls, q-tips, hair stuff, these extra room smellers because I love them. Love room smellies. Um, second drawer is all my socks and my tights because I, I just have too many bras and underwear to so keep them all in the same drawer. Then my bottom drawer, in addition to this picture that didn't have a place to go up top, I have some pictures and all my medicines because I am a sick girl in college. You gotta have the meds. And up here is my bag of unmatched socks, which I'm going to have to go through because every time I wash, I just lose one, so I decided to make a bag just for it. So, next thing is my desk. So this all came with my apartment. I didn't buy any of this furniture, so I got this little rocker chair, and underneath you can see I just rip my shoes off and just keep them underneath there. Um, got my laptop down here. Got a little cubby for my printer. Um, this is my junk drawer with pens, calculator, checkbook, all that good stuff. And here I keep a shiz ton of pens and my planner and my calendar. All days I gotta work. Gotta work every day. Work, 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 work. Um, I have my big Mac computer. This is what I got to edit my videos. Um, obviously I showed you guys my makeup stash before, so I keep that over here. Keep all the brushes on top, everything else in their drawers. If you want to see how I organize that, check out my other videos. Up here I got some candles, which I'm not allowed to light in here. Uh, some nail polish, smelly lotions, all my good smelling stuff I keep up here, some tissues. Um, this picture frame that has half old and half new pictures in it. This little elephant guy that my mom got that she didn't want and a little card that someone gave me and above I have some random art the little monkey my friend my my last roommate made for me she always called me tree monkey and then those two things I did in art class when I was in high school and I was like I'm never gonna use them so I might as well hang them up here um and by my window I just put up a thumbtack and I have all my necklaces hanging on there because I don't like putting them in that box because it just gets all wrinkled up and they get tangled. So next thing, as you can see, my drapes or curtains, and it's not focusing because it doesn't know what it's looking at, is black because I love black. I cannot sleep if there's any light. And above it, I have my beautiful 
Beatles poster. Love the Beatles. If you can tell, next point. My bed has a nice Beatles throw blanket that my friend Stephanie got me for my birthday. Um, this is my bed. Um, I got these blue covers. I got that for the sheet, the cover, and the pillowcases from Walmart. That's my favorite color, this teal turquoise color. Those are all my little stuffed animals that I've been acquiring. This is the best tapestry ever. It is Alice in Wonderland, which is my favorite childhood book. I didn't actually read it while I was a child, but I read it recently, like more recently. And I just love it. It's just the best little story. Behind my bed is this blanket. It is, um, it's not just a wall decoration. Behind it is this huge, obnoxious circle window. Like, how are you supposed to cover that up? So every night I have a big circle that you can see through the blanket, unfortunately. So that kind of stinks. Um, Full-size bed. That little desk I actually brought from home. So next to it, keep a glass of water, some chapstick, a tampon, apparently, and um, my iPod and my iHome, a little light for reading, and this is my little book pile on the ground. I just finished, well, I finished The Hunger Games a little bit ago, and I'm just waiting for someone to give me the next two. And then I have two Pretty Little Lie books, the third and the fourth. Um, then this wall has a bunch of pictures. These are all basically freshman year for the most part. Um, I need to update my pictures and put them all up because these are all pretty old. Harry Potter World, yay! Um, so last would be my closet area. I'll sit on my bed to do this. As you can see, I have two over-the-door hangers. That one on the right I got from Target for a dollar. And that one my mom got at Marshalls for like 15 But that one's sturdier, obviously. So the sturdier one, I put my towels, my robe, and my jackets occasionally. And then on the right I have belts and hair scrunchies and in that yellow bag is all my winter hats and gloves and scarves and such. Um, this is all photography that I did in high school that wasn't the ones I turned in. I have all the ones I turned in um, in like a binder but these were all like my trial ones. So yeah I'm weird that's <laughs> they look kind of odd but they were for certain projects they had a point. Um, so, in my closet of wonders, I have laundry basket, those are some shoes, um, so I have different dividers. This divider first has, top has camis, then I got shoes, 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 down in this gray one, and then in the pink one I have miscellaneous bathing suits, these three ones are my workout clothes, then I have, um, hair, irons, and purses, and then I have solid color long sleeve shirts because I just have too many winter clothes to put them all in my drawers. So the left side of my closet, I wonder if I can put my light on. Hmm. Well, if I think it'll go on if I need it. Left side of my closet has most, this mostly is going out clothes because I like to go out. I have um, my skirts all the way in the back followed by dresses and then followed by oversized shirts. I love button-down men's shirts. I just have a thing for them. I have four right now. Big oversized sweater that I couldn't fit anywhere. Um, so yeah, those are all going out clothes. And then on the right side of my closet I have all of my jackets. So I have some light jackets, some just sweaters to go on top of shirts, Big old poofy jackets and a pair of pants in the back. And then up top, I just have like a softball mitt, some tanning goggles, my lifeguard stuff, and that's where my cameras are. So I think that is all of my room. If you guys, let me go to my mirror so you guys can listen and see me. I feel like that's kind of important. Okay, so if you guys enjoyed watching my room tour and you're interested in seeing what my living room and like my bathroom and my kitchen area look, oh, I need to look at my face. 
if you want to know what those things look like that interests you in any way, let me know and I will definitely make another video like that for you. So, this is so awkward. I don't know where to look. The mirror, the camera, just, or myself. Anyway, I'm just going to turn this off. Hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys with a tutorial soon. Okay, bye.